Hey everybody, I appreciate you tuning in this video. I wanted to address a question that I get quite frequently, and actually as it gets winter, I hear it more frequently, and that is, Jared, what are you going to do when winter comes? How are you going to sell popsicles during the winter? And I'll address it three ways. The first one is from a personal or business perspective. The second one is from a physiological standpoint. The third one is from a health perspective. Now, the first thing is from a personal standpoint. Certainly, you know, the idea is when I started Pro Pops is that I wanted to sell a whole lot of popsicles. Now, ice cream companies don't go out of business during the winter. Um, you know, and they don't shut off freezers in the grocery store. The thing is that people buy that. People still buy ice cream. People still buy sorbets, and people still go to Yolati and Frulati and Spulati and Cherry Berry and all those places, again, because they want something good and tasty. So my job is to continue to create good quality products, good quality creamy products and fruit products that taste good, that people want and are addicted to and want to eat. The second thing is from a physiological standpoint. And what happens when it gets cold outside and when you have something that you eat that is cold, it actually makes everything else appear to be warmer around you. And I'll explain it like this, is that on the reciprocal end, what happens when you have a, a fever? Your body temperature increases, and so therefore, you know, you have body temperature or high heat internally, you also get the chills. Why is that? Is when your internal body temperature increases, it actually makes everything else appear to be cooler, hence the chills. Also, you know, when um, people in the summer, uh, you know, in the, in the warm climate, especially Mexico or something, they eat jalapenos pretty much all year round. Why do they do that? It increases their body temperature and it makes everything else appear cooler. That's how they can stand, well, I mean, one of the ways that they can stand, you know, 100 degree heat all the time. The third thing is from a health perspective. And if I was to say, you know what, I don't want to sell popsicles, not anybody's going to sell popsicles during the winter, we're actually getting away from the reason of why I started the Pro Pops to begin with is that I know every one of you has a family where you're just surprised at the, crap, the amount of crap that's out there in the frozen food section or on the, you know, in, in the grocery section. And I created the Jared's Pro Pops for that reason, is that I wanted to create a healthy alternative to some of the crap that's out there. And so, you know, if you take a supplement, if you take a vitamin, a multivitamin, or fish oil, or probiotics in supplement form, or if you take vitamin D or something like that, again, you're supplementing something that you're not getting from foods. So I'm trying to show you that by eating actually a popsicle, and my popsicles in particular, my probiotic popsicles, actually you're getting a good, healthy food source full of probiotics that help you do so many things. And from a health perspective, that's the key. And so having a popsicle every day, actually you're getting healthier. So if you do take a popsicle and you eat it every single day, you're getting 10 times the benefit of taking a supplement form. Why? It's in food form. So if I was to say I'm not going to sell a whole lot during the winter, it's, you know, I'm, as I said, getting away from the idea of what a um, good healthy popsicle is to begin with. So I appreciate you guys watching this. Hope you found it very beneficial and why you should go out if you see me and it's cold out to have a popsicle anyway, to eat it because you're getting healthy. So I appreciate you watching this. Comment below, share it with your friends, like this page, do something. As I said, I, I love the excitement and I want to uh, you know, continue to build this community. So I appreciate your help. You guys have a great day. I'll see you later. Peace out.